Hello friends, we meet again. Uh, by now, uh, my teaser for Comme on the Chance New Snooze uh, Hope and Glory should be up, so I hope you're enjoying that one. Uh, next week we'll have review 100, and that's a very special, famous snooze. But today, uh, more obscure snooze for review, it's Off-Road Gold by B2 Tobacco. It's a snooze that I've heard very various opinions about, actually. Uh, by the way, uh, woke up uh, the other night uh, with those big bang. Uh, what happened was that there's a storm outside, the wind had come through the open window behind here, knocked the whole thing down with the loudspeaker and all the 48 cans. <laughs> Bit of a disaster, I have to rebuild the towers again. I'll show you what that looked like. Uh, so uh, off-road, uh, I've tried the licorice, which I really liked. Off-road is a, is a highly flavored uh, brand, very cheap as well. Most of them are really highly flavoured, uh, licorice, wintergreen, mint, eucalyptus and so on. But there's also an original, a gold and a silver. And they're more traditional in taste. Um, should have like a citrus flavour to them. Maybe more citrus flavour than because it's supposed to be highly flavoured range of snoozes. Then V2 Tobacco makes Thunder, which is strong, and Phantom, which is a traditional flavoured snooze. Yeah, so it should be a low value, like a value for money snooze, really. But I've tried Thunder Loose and I've tried Phantom. Those are the two more traditional tasting, or supposed to be traditional tasting from B2. Did not like either of those, so I'll, I'll be brutally honest about this one. Uh, if I don't like it, I will tell you so. Uh, it has uh, 20 portions in it. Uh, the portions are 0.9 grams and normal nicotine of 7.2 milligrams per portion. The catch lid is a small one. Let's get into it. Normal, original looking portions, no slim factor there. They are looking pretty decent. Standard stuff really. Nothing to complain about. Pretty well fluffed up. Put one in and smell it. Well, it, <laughs> it's either kitchen cleaner or bathroom cleaner. Uh, could be window cleaner as well. It, it's a oh, one of a kind, this one. It does not smell like Phantom or Thunder Loose. Still different to those, but yes, it's very citrusy, but in a cleaning product sort of way. One of a kind, really, in smell. It, so yeah, it is sort of highly flavored, probably, or highly scented with the citrus. But it's, it's a cleaning product, citrus. See if I can get through this one, and I'll get back and tell you what I think about off-road gold. Window cleaner, I think I narrowed it down to. Can I say anything good about this one? Um, it's cheap, and it's not tasteless, but uh, when the taste is like this, uh, personally I would like it to be a bit more tasteless than it is. You can keep it up there for a while, and it might not release too much, but I like to taste my snooze, see what's really in there. And this one, I do get that window cleaner, unfresh citrus uh, with a sort of an unfresh tobacco in the background. Uh, the tobacco is not completely funky like I get in uh, Thunder Loose, for instance, but it's not very good. Uh, and the citrus is quite highly flavored, but it's not completely artificial like they put loads in there, but whatever they put in, it's, it's really unfresh, there's quite a lot of flavor to it, too much. If I put it down there, it makes me slightly nauseous, really don't want to do that. I don't think I'll finish this can. And it's weird because, um, yeah, although off-road is really cheap, I love the um, Licorice Loose, and I really think you should try that one. A really good aniseed, uh, like a Sambuca taste to it. Uh, when it comes to, to uh, citrus snoozes, I mean, yes, you, you can pick this one up from uh, snooze24.com if you're a masochist. Um, personally, I wouldn't do that. Uh, if you want a cheap citrusy snooze, I would go for something like Taboka, any of those really, because it's got a clean, nice, quality tobacco in there with a good, clean citrus taste. 
Here, tobacco is a bit dank and uh, the flavouring is just quite off, off the road, down the ditch with this one. I think they've, they've gone completely off road and um, yeah, it's, it's one of my least favourites uh, so far. It, it's one I struggle with. Uh, when it comes to some nicotine, normal, you get a little bit of spiciness maybe, but it's hardly worth talking about. It's, it's mainly about that, that pretty, pretty bad uh, unfresh citrus cleaning product. It really is. I don't know how, why it's even on the market. But try the other off-roads. The flavoured ones might be good. Uh, this one, traditional, it even says here. Classic tobacco taste. It's not. It's cleaning product. So I'm going to give this one a 2 out of 10. I think that's my lowest rated one so far. Would not recommend this at all. Uh, but next week we have review number 100 and it's a much better snooze. So I hope to see you then. Thanks for watching guys. Bye.